I may finally have found a place where I can be all. And word. 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 Alright, so Jack Doherty is in the news today for a clip that he produced on his stream. Drama Alert says, did Jack Doherty just drop the N-word with a hard R? And the clip that we're gonna play, obviously, you guys can answer that for yourself. Well, actually, I mean, on the off chance that he actually did say it, which the reason I say off chance we'll get into, I do want to play it safe with YouTube and just censor it in case, but before we get into anything, I just want to make it clear that either way, true or not, I don't really care. And I specifically don't care because Jack Doherty is somebody that I already hate. And like, if this is even true, this isn't even in the top 10 list of worst things that this guy has done. I mean, we have the public harassment campaigns that he frequently takes place in in order to clip farm off innocent civilians and plebeians that are living their day-to-day -day life in peace that he approaches and literally harasses for the sake of content. We also have pretty casual standard human trafficking accusations with people saying he will find girls and take them on the time of their life for like a week on boats, in his mansions, in his sports cars, and then and when they turn 18, he shoves a contract in their face, suggesting that they should basically agree to get them on OF, and when they do, he takes like 40% of everything they make every month. Here's the number one. Hey, Jack, fuck you, bro. I was actually speaking highly of you for the first time. You want to come here and talk shit? It's all good, bro. It's all good. It's all good. I just don't give a fuck anymore, man. I, I, I just don't care, bro. The crazy thing is, Jack, you would not say that's my face, bro. You're a fucking joke. Let me tell you exactly what Jack does. I don't care. You want to say that? Now I'm going to violate you and expose your script. Here's what you do. I'm going to tell you exactly what you do. You get 17-year-old girls the night before their birthday. You got you buy a $10,000 yacht every time. You get them drunk and they sign a contract 50% of their life every single time. Fuck you. Which makes sense. If you've seen the picture of him surrounded by girls, these are all girls that he quote-unquote manages, which... <laughs> When he say manages, you'd think he's got to be doing a lot of work in order to get 40% of what they're making every month. When in reality, the actual managing he's doing is sitting on his ass and actually not doing anything. Anyway, though, here's the clip. Thank you, Those order screens are so unhygienic. No. All right, well, you probably haven't had food in six days. Now, I am pretty certain he does say hater after listening to his explanation. Like, if you go and find this clip and then hear the word hater in your head while he's saying it, it, it becomes clear that he's saying it. But surprisingly, this has become like a Yanny Laurel Tear audio illusion. And unfortunately, it is on one of the, you know, most cancelable words ever. But <laughs> it is definitely kind of funny. And it's very interesting, too. He makes this very impassioned response, jaw wide open in the first frame of the video. You can see he's ready to go to bat and defend his honor and legacy, which is so rich because this is like the least important slash controversial thing he's actually done. Like, say what you want, you know, you could say, oh, this is the worst thing you could possibly say or whatever, but I think, you know, literally possibly G-R-O-O-M-I-N-G underage girls to join OF and starting, you know, public harassments, you know, to strangers is, is far worse than just saying that in a McDonald's. <laughs> These allegations against Jack are immoral at best and criminal at worst, so I wanted to vet these claims by interviewing her, see what receipt she had. She seemed down and then she proceeded to ignore me for the next three weeks, while continuously posting about the supposed grooming. And has she brought forward any other victims to substantiate these claims? No. Has she posted the contract as proof? No. Even the victim she claims was groomed doesn't seem to have a problem. She doesn't have one post talking about this. She's still posting videos with Jack. It's really messed up because she's either telling the truth and is too stupid to substantiate these claims, hurting future victims that fall for these contracts, or she's making it up for clout hurting actual victims that come forward, which is possible because she's willing to do anything for views. She faked being a file for views. But look how upset he is that people are mishearing him. I literally cannot believe I have to do this right now. How the fuck do people think I said the goddamn n-word? Are you retarded? Imagine being at the airport trying to catch some Z's after a long hard day of work and you're finally getting to fly back to see your family. And this jackass in his red hoodie is pacing around the gate being like, I can't believe I have to clear this up. He's yelling at a camera. I literally said hater. Watch the video back. And when I say the word hater, say the word hater in your head if you God, dude, you know, I wasn't gonna forgive you, but when I saw this cute face, I was like, <laughs> I can't be mad at you, Jack. Say the other word in your head, it makes it sound like it says the other word, but I'm, I literally talk so fast that it sounds like it, but 
I said hater, I say- Unironically, this video itself is more obnoxious than the first video. Like, even if he- Freeze frame is hilarious, by the way. This is like the pot of greed in Magic the Gathering. I'm not even joking. This video in itself is more obnoxious than this one, even if he did say the N-word. Because if he said it here, he literally whispered it to the camera, hurt nobody in the process. Whereas this one, he's walking around the airport yelling for like half a minute straight. Probably woke some people up, some poor bastards trying to catch some Zs. And it's just, I'm, I'm bothered, all right? The word, I say fucking hater all the time time like if you watch any of my videos you know i say that shit like what the fuck is this shit i'm literally gonna sue all these fucking people saying i said that word because they're literally saying i said it straight up fuck that shit he's gonna sue people that are saying that he said the n-word that's fantastic yeah he's not gonna sue the people that are providing evidence to the claim that he might be going after underage girls or anyone highlighting the public harassment he takes place in because he knows he's guilty on that but when you accuse him of saying the n-word which you may even have a pass for considering it's white boy summer that's where you draw the line? Okay, that's fantastic. WTF is wrong with you people! Say the word hater in your head while watching the video. You can clearly hear I said hater. I would never say the n-word. Again, he's just so passionate. He, he has such good morals. He would never say such an offensive word. You know, he's a good guy, a harmless guy. You know, he doesn't want to hurt anybody. Why would you say just kidding to hater? I mean, yeah, I mean, obviously you can make the argument that it looks bad. I, I would say it's pretty, uh, I, I would say it's, it's clearly after you hear him clarify it, that he, he probably is saying hater. I heard you said hater Hater, not n-word if people took time find a quiet place to rehear the clip multiple times high volume you can hear he said hater the thing is though but like are, are we like what, what is the point of this i'm gonna sit down in a quiet room with noise canceling next generation headphone technology with dolby atmos audio to hear him say hater instead of the n-word like i just don't care about this guy honestly too like if you did hear the n-word i'm not even gonna sit there and like correct you like i don't this guy doesn't deserve benefit of the doubt i always say the n-word especially with the hard r who is this guy Ah, okay. <laughs> Makes sense. Let's go to his page. What is he even doing here? Even no jumper deleted their post because they know they're spreading false information because they know I didn't say it. Everyone is just trying to bring me down over something I didn't do. Well, you didn't clarify it. Like, is, it, is this guy actually dumb? Like, they issued a correction. They're not spreading false information. Bro, if they if they, if they they take a clip of you saying something and you, you're almost certain that you hear a certain word and then you say, hey, I actually didn't say that word. Okay, then they're going to delete it because then you've issued a correction. You've clarified no one's trying to bring you down. We were just, you know, certain you said a certain word, brother. But look at him. He's just going crazy. Wait, he married? Check this out. Pop it. Pop it. Oh. Yes. Yes. Oh my god. We just... I love Dubai. We are in Dubai. How do I do this? God, I hate this guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. She got to the ball. Hey, wait. These niggas watching. I swear to God, they be my clothes. Yeah. Switching my hoes like my flows. Switching my face like my clothes. Keep on shooting.